required to live in a, li a rural life in the city of L.A. The bumpy ride to and from home for residents in Tahunga's Riverwood community. The rain swollen to Hunga Wash flooded Oro Vista Avenue, forcing residents to use a fire road past a locked gate. We showed you during the last storm and returned today, finding the back road passable if challenging, and fire personnel staged in the community. In your month, they have tents now and porta potties. <laughs> they take shifts to go and find food. And, and that's just to make sure you guys are all okay up here. It, I guess because the response time would be too long if somebody needed serious help. Someone like his neighbors, disabled senior citizens. They're ready in case somebody gets hurt or has a heart attack or whatever. It's part of living up here, the, the bonus of living up here, having the privacy and the safety and being in the middle of nature. So he is staying put, as are many of his neighbors, which in turn is affecting local businesses like car washes. Used to being slow in the winter, they've gotten walloped financially with the continuous and heavier rains. So have restaurants, especially those with outdoor patios like the backdoor bakery. We kind of compensate by doing, we do curbside service mm -hmm. and people are taking advantage of that. And we also do uh, deliveries as, as well. And we do our own in-house deliveries. But they can't wait for sunnier weather. Well, the patio will be alive again. <laughs> And we're nice and cozy inside right now, so, yeah. you know, inside is really a nice place to be. You can watch the storm instead of be in the storm. 